much better. Thank you, Mary. She is so kind. <laughs> Kind indeed. Oh, that's rich. Why, she'd cut you down and stick you in a vase as soon as look at you. Well, what's wrong with that? We like it. You flower fairies make me sick. You just sit back on your petals and ask to be exploited. Flies are different. We know who the enemy is. Human beings. Tomorrow we strike. It's Mary's birthday party tomorrow. Exactly. Seek out and destroy the enemy in the greatest possible numbers. <laughs> That's the way to win battles. We flies are organized. Why, I've a tie-up with the chief of the germs that's the last word in strategy. <laughs> are these humans going to be sick? How can we help? What can we do to save Mary and her family? I think I know. Tonight, when the moon rises, we'll meet in Mary's bedroom. Germs in the sneeze for pollution and filth and infection. We'll wipe off our feet on somebody's meat and hope it's a lethal injection. <laughs> <laughs> this is the plan of attack, boys. First objective, the dustbin. <laughs> we meet there tomorrow as the sun reaches the kitchen window. Understood? <laughs> There's a battalion of germs waiting to be picked up. We fly them straight into the larder. That's where the food for the party is. After that, it's up to the germs. <laughs> and if I know them, we've nothing to worry about. Oh, that's great, Gov. That's nothing. Wait till you hear the rest. What, Gov? Aunt Peggy's coming to the party. Not Mary's Aunt Peggy. Who else, stupid? Our allies, the airborne germs, have been at work. And she's got a cold. Right! <laughs> that's it. That's it. Make her sneeze. Make her sneeze. And you'll be able to spread infection to all the family. <laughs> but don't underestimate the enemy. Remember, avoid handkerchiefs if you can, or you may be trapped. Even worse, you may be killed in disinfectant. <laughs> the flies calling chief of the germs chief of the flies calling chief of the germs are you receiving me over chief of the germs to chief of the flies am receiving you over <laughs> nice work Willie you're doing fine but I want your boys to pep up work on Aunt Peggy's tonsils I'm counting on that cold to put the whole household to bed for a week <laughs> over your message received and understood. Just leave it to me, Bertram.
Mary, dear, I want you to look after the house. Tommy and I are going to meet Aunt Peggy. Take that cold right back to bed. Goodbye, dear. Goodbye. <laughs> 